Hey guys, welcome back. It's me Rajan Sharma and in this tutorial we will be learning. I will show you that how can we create a functionality of showing total number of new messages of a group. So you can see that in this uh, we have a group which is Sharma IT services and here you can see one as a new message count. Okay, so this is the functionality that we will implement in this tutorial and for so and for source code you have to visit rajansharma.com. My PayPal account is available. My new PayPal account is available. Do not send money on old one okay so this is what i'm going to show you in this tutorial all you have to do is watch this tutorial completely follow all the steps and write down every line of code without making any mistake and everything will work okay so after implementing this tutorial when you will run the application so you will see new message count of a specific group okay so without wasting time let's start so guys very first of all you can see that this is our project chat it okay and uh, you have to open the group item.xml file very first of all and guys here you have to add this extra text view it is quite similar like the one we are using for this uh, uh, list item okay here you can see where we are showing the new message count okay so same uh, layout code you can use for this group item as well and the only thing that you have to do is you have to change this m number tv and you have to add extra two words which is gc means group chat okay so this is all you have to do and you can see that here it is uh, showing okay now after that you have to open this group chat and very first of all you have to declare reference uh, document reference which is doc ref count and uh, then a second thing is integer uh, variable which is m count okay then after that you have to open this on create and uh, simply we have to give the reference of doc ref count you can simply uh, pause the video write down the code and if you want the source code you can simply join uh, membership on my uh, website rajansharma.com in case you're not capable of doing it so you can simply uh, send money on paypal and the third option is you can simply join membership on my youtube channel but the problem is that if you will join it on youtube channel so you may not get the updated codes okay because on website i keep updating on regular basis and on channel i share the drive link okay so you can see that this is a reference that you have to give then after that uh, here you have to simply use uh, add value listener for single event okay and uh, then you can see the code inside it okay simply you have to write group chat add listener for single event okay then m count and here you, you can simply uh, use this toast okay or if you want you can avoid it it's not important and then you have to create a map and we will store the value of total number of messages okay here you can see count and total number of messages in a group chat okay so the logic here that we are building is uh, we will fetch total number of messages in a group okay and then we will store that value as seen okay so total number of messages we will store as seen for a specific user okay so every time uh, let's say for example if a group have 10 total messages and uh, when the user will open the activity so we will save 10 value as seen okay now 10 uh, group messages 10 uh, seen messages it means that user have no new messages okay but now if a group have 15 new messages and user value have only uh, for 10 messages as seen so we will simply do the subtraction that 15 minus 10 equals to 5 so we will show that user have 5 unread messages so this is a very simple logic that we are using here it is not complicated you just have to vis watch this complete tutorial and uh, follow all the steps and it will work okay so you have to simply write down this add listener for single value event here we are fetching the total number of uh, uh, message count okay and then here we are storing that inside the document reference that we have created above then second thing you have to do is you have to uh, call the on back press method and again we will do the same coding here nothing is different everything is same okay and again comment this toast now after that guys what you have to do you have to open this group vh okay and here you have to declare a variable for text view which is m number tvgc and then second thing you have to do is integer total count and then string scene count okay uh, you know, declare these three variables and then you have to create a method which is tech m count okay very first of all you have to give the reference and make sure you pass three parameters which is address current user id and group name okay then you have to give the reference for group chat which is group chat address okay uh, second you have to give the reference for document which is doc ref count firebase firestore get instance collection gc count and current user id plus group name okay this is the same reference that we are using here in this group chat as well um here you can see okay current user id plus group name after that what you have to do is you have to use a handler okay and then inside that handler we will do the calculation so you can see that here we are simply fetching the total number of messages of a group okay you can see total number of messages here we have total number of messages and then we are fetching the total number of messages user have seen so you can see doc ref count dot get seen count okay here we will simply fetch that value that we are storing in firestore okay 
and after that we will convert that string into a integer here you can see that we are converting the scene count to this scene integer and then we are doing with a validation that if total count and scene equals to it means that user have no new messages so we will simply make this m number tbdc gone and then if it is not uh, equal so we will make it visible okay and then later we can simply store this value here like m number tbdc dot set text string dot value of total count minus scene okay in the s part we will simply initialize it as a zero and again the process is simple we will convert scene count to scene then we will do the validation then we will make it gone or visible and then we will store the value so this is what we are going to do in this tutorial and you can see the complete code on the screen it is quite simple and easy to implement and in case if you face any errors so you can simply let me know in comment section and you can join membership okay and you will get all the codes so this was the complete and simple process that we are doing here okay and uh, yes so it looks like this so you can see the complete code here inside this group chat and here we will simply use this uh, uh, we will delay this uh, execution for two seconds fine and uh, this was a complete code for group ph and the important thing now you have to open the fragment too and inside this on start inside this firebase regular options firebase recycler adapter inside this method which is on bind v holder you have to call this method holder dot check m count and pass three parameters at this correct user id and group name so you can see that this was a complete tutorial and complete steps that you have to follow in order to implement this functionality okay so i hope you guys understood everything that i have told you in this tutorial okay and after implementing these functionality after implementing this part of code you will be able to show new number of uh, i mean number of new messages of a group okay so if you like this tutorial please like share and subscribe my channel and for source code visit rajansharma.com or paypal you have to uh, send money on my new paypal account old one is not working okay i have deactivated that account for some reasons okay guys so thank you for watching